Hi, cybersecurity professionals. Today, I'll be starting a new topic for our learning. I'll be going through data privacy in IT project management. There will be a lot of different sharing throughout this channel. So everyone will be able to gear themselves up to be a fully competent as a cybersecurity professional. And remember, our objective is to gear everyone up to be cybersecurity professionals. Or learn tricks and tips to keep yourself safe from cyber attacks. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you all for the support and encouragement given to me throughout the time. And your participation to stay active with this channel. Do keep the support coming by subscribing to this channel, like, comment, and share it around. Previously, we have learned and shared about cybersecurity awareness and getting into ethical hacking. And moving on next, I'll be sharing about data privacy in IT project management. The key and end objective of a cybersecurity professional are to protect and ensure that data is safe and protected when they are in use, in transit, and storage. In the business environment, data are retrieved, shared, and analyzed either from an internal or external source. Such data are used to improve employee engagement, increase employee productivity, improves interdepartmental communications, improves knowledge sharing efforts, improves customer satisfaction and retention, and build a better company culture. So let us prepare ourselves for the new knowledge of data privacy. But before we jump into today's sharing, I would like to take this opportunity to give a quick introduction about myself. This is for you to know me better. I am Dr. Tan Kien Hua, and I'm part of the prestigious Lakes Texture team and serve as an adjunct professor of management, international business, and cybersecurity. I'm the school lead lecturer for cybersecurity, designing the cybersecurity course material and content for their lesson. I am also part of the mentoring team with Cybri. Being the assistant mentor with Cybri, I help to mentor IT, information technology, and cybersecurity professionals in their committee. As their assistant mentor, I provide a career guide, clearing those professionals' technical inquiries, and helping them to review resumes and candidates for their potential hire. I'm not sure if you have heard about Cybri. If you have not heard about them, just a quick background on who they are. Cybri builds its presence over the internet and they are an online committee that provides free and paid IT and cybersecurity courses for anyone keen to learn or upgrade their skills in their free time. They provide mentorships, support, with a hacking laboratory for their pay members. And as of today, they are having more than 2 million active members globally. As for my full-time job, I am the principal consultant, engaged by numerous companies to serve as their virtual chief information security officer, the CISO in short. My main duty will be to advise on their local and overseas offices, operations across the Asia-Pacific region. During the pandemic last year, my company was engaged by China, Hong Kong, and Korea company as their cybersecurity and data privacy consultants. If you are keen to find out more about what is a virtual chief information security officer, be CISO in short. Do look out for my other videos on cybersecurity. 
you'll be able to learn more and gear yourself up to be a cybersecurity specialist. In terms of personal data protection, I am a seasoned data privacy advisor and serve as an advisor in data privacy for system integrators to fine tune their cybersecurity and data privacy framework and to enhance their internal policy. Some of the professional certifications which I hold are CIPPUS, Certified Information Privacy Professional, United States. This is one of the gold-plated data privacy certifications that certify that the individual has obtained top-tier management and strategy level in the data privacy industry. This is one of the recognized professional certifications when it comes to data privacy. CIPM, Certified Information Privacy Manager. The CIPM designations says that you are leader in privacy program administrator and that you have got the knowledge to establish, maintain, and manage a privacy program across all stages of its life cycle. CISM, Certified Information Security Manager. This is also another gold-plated cybersecurity certification that certified that the individual has obtained top-tier management and strategy level in the cybersecurity industry. This is one of the recognized professional certifications when it comes to cybersecurity. CISA, Certified Information Systems Auditor. By the name, we will be able to tell that a professional holding on to these certifications can audit the information system. This is getting more popular as people are more concerned with data protection and auditing is part of the scope. CDPSC, Certified Data Privacy Solution Engineer. A data privacy certification that defines the ability of the professional to design and protect personal or company data. As I always like to say, you will be able to better protect yourself if you know the strategy of the attacker or hacker. Therefore, I have equipped myself with CEH, Certified Ethical Hacker. Not forgetting my ABDP, Advanced Big Data Professional Certifications. Understanding Big Data is a must in today's environment. Big Data is everywhere. Even for ethical hacking, you also require the knowledge of Big Data to ensure a smooth and successful process. Today, we only have one objective to understand how to up your career in data privacy as a project manager. Privacy is a growing sector that has now been spotlight. Learning and getting yourself to be a CDPSC, Certified Data Privacy Solution Engineer, will give you a more holistic view of your customers and gain useful customer insights while learning and retaining customer trust to boost productivity and profitability and ensure good data privacy in place. Becoming part of the solutions to implement a successful and comprehensive privacy programs in your projects and company. Holding these certifications validates your experience and ability to build and implement comprehensive privacy solutions. Bridging the gaps between data scientists, analysts, privacy technologies, and legal compliance professionals. CDPSC holders can facilitate a common understanding of privacy best practices throughout the company to ensure 
the proper integrations of privacy solutions that mitigates risk while ensuring an optimum end-user experience. IT projects managers are encouraged to go for these certifications as it showcases your technical expertise and validates your understandings and abilities to implement privacy-enhanced design. Working across functional with legal policies, engineers, software developers, and back-end and front-end experts. This is one of the gold plated privacy certifications that is experience-based and required certifications holders to maintain and add to their knowledge. This is more of a data privacy certifications and not cybersecurity certifications. Another certification that's good for IT project managers to have will be CIPM, Certified Information Privacy Manager by IAPP. IAPP also refers to International Associations of Privacy Professionals. IAPP is a resource for professionals who want to develop and enhance their career by helping their companies successfully manage the risks and protect their data. IAPP refers to only the place that brings together the people, tools, and global information management practices you need to thrive in today's rapid evolving information economy. And IT project manager can make a difference in his company and his career. The CIPM destination says that he is a leader in privacy programs, administrations, and that he has the knowledge to establish, maintain, and manage a privacy programs across all stages of his life cycle. Having the operational ability to turn policies into programs, make data privacy regulations work for a company by understanding how to implement them in day-to-day -day operations. Learn to create a company visions. Structure a data protection team. Develop and implement system frameworks. Communicate to stakeholders. Manage performance and more. Thank you for your time and interest in finding out and the support to find out more about data privacy. The eagerness to learn and gear oneself up to be a professional may be tiring at the start. But do not give up and keep the determination going. You will be able to reach there one fine day. If you still find any missing gaps or need to recap your understanding to review the topics, do so by replaying the video. I'll see you soon in the next sharing.